Hi, this is Andy Robinson, the Potato Extension Agronomist at North Dakota State University and the University of Minnesota. Today what we're going to do is show you how to use a potato diagnostics form. This form is intended to help potato growers and those associated with potato production to quickly upload different kind of problems or questions that they might have in their potato fields, storage bins, or wherever it might be. By doing this we'll be able to respond to you quickly and hopefully help you diagnose your, diagnose your problem in a quicker manner. So to show you how this is done simply just fill in your name, your email, and your phone number. This information is important. If we have other questions or would like to make a visit to the field, we'll want to be able to be able to contact you. Typing in the correct potato variety is also important because this will help us understand what issues might occur to that variety. Some varieties are more susceptible to, to diseases than other varieties. Also, indicate your state. This service is a service for North Dakota and Minnesota growers, so if you're in another state or country, we suggest you contact your local extension agent or agronomist to help you with your problems. And finally, just put in a short description of the problem. Um, you can put whatever it might be, what might be going on, field history, pattern in the field, etc. Um, and you just simply type that in. And then finally, the most important thing would be to upload a few pictures. We suggest that you upload two to three, but you can upload up to five pictures, a close up, a further out, maybe uh, two or three pictures in there. Showing the problem will be really helpful in helping us diagnose it. So all you do, quickly, simply click the browse, um, select your picture. You can select again multiple pictures here, like I'm showing you. After you do that, you can hit the submit button. If you're using an iPhone, tablet, uh, any type of mobile phone uh, when you click the picture browse button there uh, you will likely be able to have the option also to take a picture so that's very easily done if you're out in the field when you're done with this hit the submit button as long as all the fields are filled in correctly it will get submitted I will get an email and we'll be in touch with you shortly thank you